Okay, in this video I'm going to show you very quickly how to make a circuit in Visio. Um, so let's assume you start with a blank drawing. Let's go to engineering and choose uh, electrical engineering. And you can choose uh, very simply uh, the fundamental items for a circuit. All right, and you'll see that now you have uh, some of these fundamental items. Uh, Again, the zoom needs to uh, come in significantly so you have a good idea uh, what size you're working with. Uh, alternatively, you can increase the size of everything so you can make it bigger. Um, and uh, at the end, you probably will want to change the line size on everything to make it much thicker. And then you can drag items like a resistor uh, or a capacitor into your circuit. Uh, you can include things like ground. Uh, you can include an inductor. One big thing with the inductor is that uh, in real circuit drawings we typically don't like uh, our inductors to have legs like this so we can close it up. Uh, and then to finish the circuit off, uh, a circuit is a closed path and so we need to use a connector. And what I'll do is first of all uh, connect between these and you'll see that there's a problem that a right angle connector wants to do uh, goofy things and so I'm going to change it to a straight connector all right and you'll see that the line width of that is different uh, I can choose line and look at the weight and it looks like it's three quarters so I might also want to select all of these things all I'm doing is shift and click on each of them and change the line weight to all be three quarters so that way it matches up. Uh, and then I'm going to copy and paste uh, this line a few different places uh, so that way I can uh, connect my circuit together. All right, um, and so uh, another thing to note. Uh, as we're doing this is if you make a mistake and you need it to go away uh, you really the only way to do that uh, delete does not work uh, you need to right click and choose cut alright that's how you get rid of something uh, that you don't want uh, in there and I'm just going to finish up this circuit uh, and really uh, th that's all there is to making a circuit. Of course you can make more complicated circuits uh, by adding uh, more devices uh, and that is uh, pretty much all there is to it. Uh, one thing I will uh, point out to you is that you can uh, change the font here. Uh, let's make it 12. You can make it times New Roman. You can say something like 10 volts. Alright, it's a 10 volt source. Uh, you might also want to annotate uh, the values of each of these uh, components. So uh, you do that by clicking text and choosing, uh, for example, let's say this is 10 ohms. All right, I wrote it 10, uh, and then I'm going to want to insert a symbol, uh, and omega is the ohm symbol. All right, and so I can come back, uh, set this to be times New Roman. All right then uh, I can go back to the pointer tool which allows me to select I can uh, copy and paste let's call this 10 Henry's and then let's call this over here 10 Farad and now I have at least given uh, the circuit values and so everything there makes sense